Greetings and welcome to a new video. In this video, I will show you how to jailbreak iOS 15.5.7 using Mac OS with the Pale Rain jailbreak. This guide will work on all versions supported by the Pale Rain jailbreak. So, if a new version appears and the Pale Rain jailbreak is compatible, I will update it in the title or in the description. So you can see I have this iPhone 7 on iOS 15.7.1 and it is not jailbroken as you can see. Alright guys, so I am on macOS right now. First of all, open the main GitHub page of Pale Rain Jailbreak. Pale Rain Jailbreak is completely free and you can get it for free from its official GitHub page. You can see that it now supports up to iOS 15.7.1 on all the checkmate devices. But before we can use the Pale Rain jailbreak, we will have to install some packages. It is very easy to do. First of all, you will have to install Homebrew. Open the main website of Homebrew, which is completely free, and simply copy this code from here. Now simply open a new terminal and paste the whole command here and press enter. Now type in your login password and press enter now press enter once again and let the installation complete all right guys when the homebrew installation is done you will have to install these packages by typing this command brew install lib i mobile device space lib i recovery and press enter Alright guys, so this command will install all the required packages. For me, it is showing they are up to date because I have used this command previously. You can now simply minimize this terminal window and then you will have to install Python. Open the main website for Python. It is also completely free. Go to downloads, go to macOS and from here you can download this macOS 64 universal installer. So I have downloaded this package file already for Python. So simply double click and install it and then simply install software. Finally, we can proceed to the Pale Rain jailbreak. This guide will also work on any version that comes after 15.7.1 and it is supported by Pale Rain because the installation method will be the same. So make sure that you are on the main branch of Pale Rain. The information on this GitHub page might change as developers update it. So act accordingly and scroll down and you will see this command. Simply copy it from here. Then simply open a terminal, type CD and go to downloads. Then simply paste this whole command here and press enter this will clone the pale rain jailbreak to your download directory so wait until this is complete all right so when this is done we are good to go with pale rain now to use the pale rain jailbreak you will have to run this command sudo dot slash pale rain dot sh hyphen hyphen tweaks and the version you are on but you can have the semi tethered mode by typing semi-tethered in front of tweaks but please keep in mind that semi-tethered takes 10 GB of extra space on your device so it is only recommended for 32 GB or higher devices so in this video I will go with the tethered mode now connect your device to your computer by USB cable and get it to DFU mode right, so my device is now in DFU mode you can close out of finder and type the command here sudo dot slash pale rain dot sh hyphen hyphen tweaks so i am on 15.7.1 currently make sure that you are in the pale rain directory you can cd into it and then drag the folder in if you are not in now press enter here type in your password for your login and press enter if you're using the tethered mode, you will have to type these phrases as is. So I will quickly type them and press enter. 
you will see enabling tweaks getting device info and then it will start creating the ram disk and then it will download some files so relax and let this process complete so after the files are downloaded they will be processed so wait here until this is complete now here it will start downloading some more files for bootstrap for celio and so on now when this process is complete your device will be booted now guys when your device boots up your blobs from your device will be dumped so wait for this process to complete now here it will download more files and then it will process them now when this process is complete your device will be rebooted into recovery mode so wait until this is done and now you will have to get it into dfu mode press enter and wait and now just follow the instructions and now you can see my device entered dfu now it will download some more files after these files are downloaded they will be processed and then it will boot your device now when this is complete you can simply close out of pale rain and then i will show you how to set up celio and everything else all right so guys so here is my iphone 7 i want to show you the version again 15.7.1 same device so make sure you are connected to the wi-fi open the tips app and it should be the pogo loader this time now tap install and this will start installing the bootstrap now you will see this dialog click always allow and you are done now you should see celio on your home screen open it allow and first of all i want to show you the version 15.7.1 iphone 7 home button works just fine and you can check it out here that everything seems to work just fine everything is properly populated that's all for this video guys if you still have questions please ask in the comment section and i will reply you as soon as possible i will see you in a new video goodbye